Hello, I'm Yannis, and welcome to a new Precious Plastic video. So, in this video, I will show you how the Beyond Plastic workspace operates, um, and that includes our collection system, our dehydrator, our material bank where we store and organize our materials, and also, of course, our machine where we will make a beautiful bowl from uh, mostly orange peels, which is one of the many recipes that you can find in the download kit. Um, yeah, check them out and then we can, I can show you how it works. Let's go. All right, so we got some orange peels that someone probably made a fresh orange juice this morning. Um, and now we need to dry them so they don't get moldy or get eaten by flies. Um, for that, we have our dehydrator. It's a very basic thing. It's a wooden box that has a little heating element in the bottom and a ventilation on the top, which sucks the air through so that all of our things can dry. So we can dry our coffee, and we got some other orange peels here. Um, yeah, some more coffee, some tea, all of that stuff. So we can make some space, place these in here, and then wait a little until they're dry. So this is our material bank where we store all of our materials. Um, we store them in these glass jars that we rescued from the restaurants around us because they would throw them away otherwise. Um, and we store the stuff that we use a lot in these bigger containers. Um, and on the inside of those containers, we are using also paper bags from flour um, because that keeps everything a little cleaner and a little bit more food safe. Um, yeah, so I would say now we can make a beautiful bowl from orange peels. All right, so we measured our amount of orange peels. Now we only need to add a little bit of water. The mold is already preheated, so then we can fill up the mold and press them. So we built the sliding mechanism on the machine, which makes it super simple to slide back and forth the mold and also have it aligned when you press it. Um, I'm using some sunflower seed oil right now to um, like pre-oil the mold a little bit when I press so that um, the material doesn't get stuck so often because cleaning the mold is a little bit annoying. And um, you can also not use it. It also works without oil. But yeah, when it gets stuck, it's just a little bit annoying to clean. So I'm using oil for that. All right, then we can put our material in. And slide it back inside, close the release, and pump it up. Now we have to set the timer. All right, it's time to open. Cool, so with the orange peels, it's actually funny because you can control the color of the bowl by um, the heat and the time that you have it in the press. 
Um, if you want more like a golden brown, you can actually turn the temperature up a little bit or leave it in a little longer. And if you want more like a bright yellow, you can go for a lower temperature or take it out a bit quicker. Um, and what's also important is you can either use these as soon as they are cold um, or you can, um, if you want to produce more of them, you can put them in the dehydrator to get rid of the leftover moisture. You just shouldn't stack them um, after you make them because they still have some moisture that they otherwise will not be able to get rid of and then mold might come. Alright, cool. So now we made a salad. Super tasty. You can also serve a soup or an ice cream or whatever you want. If you also want to get started, make sure to check out our website and our download kit for other recipes with other materials, for the plans on how to build this machine and how to set up your own workspace. And hopefully see you soon in the community of people who make biodegradable stuff. Bon appetit. Wait, 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 before you go, just want to let you know that Precious Plastic runs on the support of people just like you. Everything we publish is open source online for free so that everyone in the world can start tackling the plastic waste problem. If you'd like to support us, please go to support.preciousplastic.com where you can make a small donation or find out another way to help. Thanks a lot.